Hey, so let's implement this image role. Uh, recall that the uh, image role is the uh, view that just gives us all the images for all of the notes uh, in our data store. In the notebook case, they were uh, uh, most recent first, but we don't have that information in the file names. And so we're just gonna grab them all. So we are gonna go to our view model where our uh, data comes from and if you recall, uh, there was a refresh all images um, uh, method that actually grabs the list of images. And uh, because it actually has to go over the network to get the list of all images, we wanna start that as soon as possible. Um, so we're gonna, we're, gonna put that up, we're gonna put that up here. And it, we're actually calling that before we even call super on view created. Uh, because super on view created is going to do some standard some standard stuff but we, we want to get this uh, network request rolling so uh, we've got our super and now we have our image view um, uh, recycler view so uh, just, to, just to make it all self-contained if we go down here to our layout uh, we're looking at image role fragment and Get some text, so it's it's pretty simple, um, and in fact, it's it's exceedingly simple. Uh, it's a constraint layout, and there's not even any constraints because this thing is just match parent. So it's just one big image view recycler view. Okay, image roll, image view recycler view. Let's grab a layout manager. Our you know layout manager will be uh, my favorite. Layout manager for this case is Tigered Grid. Uh, we'll have two columns and uh, Tigered Grid uh, Layout Manager dot vertical. Okay, Let's have to do a better job of the indenting there, please. Okay, uh, uh, Layout Manager, great. Uh, and we need an adapter. And what kind of adapter are we going to? take. We are going to take an image adapter. Let's see what it, we have a notes adapter. We're not displaying a note. We are displaying a bunch of images. So our image adapter is quite adaptable because we use it uh, both in the notes view and we use it here. And that's, uh, that's by design. Uh, we have to pass it a view model, grab that uh, adapter. And of course we have to tell the image view um, Recycler view, uh, where what what adapter I'm using? It's this adapter I just created. So, pr pretty pretty straightforward so far. Pretty good. All all stuff that we've uh, generally seen. Okay, and now uh, the the final thing that we have to do is you know we need, we need to actually display uh, the the list. Um, uh, like everything in our uh, Firebook uh, FireNote. Sorry, like everything in our FireNote uh, application, uh, we're, we're explore, exporting things by live data. So we're going to set an observer here. So we're going to say uh, view model, um, observe all images. So observe all images uh, has the list of all images exported as live data. So we, we are going to observe uh, that, you know, with our view lifecycle owner and we are going to create an observer and that observer is, you know, gonna log something uh, when we're debugging. And otherwise we are going to submit this list. So, okay, yeah, let's, that's what's going on. Let's um, intent this properly. Okay, uh, uh, recycler view uh, knows what adapter it is. And then, yeah, what, what am I uh, displaying in my recycler view? I'm observing all images. Uh, that is a list of these uh, strings. Uh, the strings are uh, photo UUIDs, and we just give that list to the adapter. That's it. You know, this image adapter, it takes a list, uh, it takes a view model, it takes, you know, if you want to delete, which we don't want to delete. Um, this view model is, is taking 
uh, yeah, it's taking a list of picture UUIDs. All right, so yeah, unbind, uh, yeah, the, the current list, it's a, it, the, the, uh, hold on. where, where am I? Sorry. Oh, here, here we go. Okay. So, sorry, I'm looking, looking for my bind function. So, uh, let's keep it in there. Okay. My bind function takes a picture UID, takes the position. We fetch everything using glide. Um, and then, uh, if we have a, a delete function, uh, we use that. And so for the image role, this is taking the, uh, observe all images which let's find out where that is defined. It's defined here in our view model. This is a, a live data. It's being exported. Um, if we refresh all images, let's look at that. Refresh all images. That is calling into the storage object. And if you recall, uh, it passes a, um, passes a, a callback. Uh, we looked at this uh, function definition when we looked at the storage object, but um, this uh, calls into Firebase, has Fire or uh, Firestore, calls into Firestore, has it list all of the items in its directory, passes us back this list. This is what I was looking for is where do I get my list of UUIDs? I get it um, passed from Firestore, has this uh, object, we grab the uh, file names out of that object. We pass it to this callback. This callback puts it in this uh, live data object. So in our image role, we just observe this live data object. What is the sort of format or what is this live data object? It's a list of picture UUIDs. That's why this type name is list of string. And that's it. So that gives us back Whenever we, we hit the uh, um, uh, image role, it gives us a list of all of the images in the application in no particular order. Thanks. <laughs>